Hello? Is anyone home? Hello? I brought you something. <laughs> Here you are. I thought for a second I was gonna have to turn around and leave. Well, I brought you something. I don't know, I thought... I thought maybe you could use it. Here. I made food. Dinner for you. Can I, uh... Can I come in? <laughs> well, this isn't getting any warmer, so... I thought maybe I could plate it for you. You must be hungry. What's to be confused about, darling? Her. She's fine. I already checked on her today. It's you I'm worried about. <sighs> Nasty work. I mean, she cheated on you. Look, she's my best friend, but she has poor judgment. Look, we don't have to talk about any of that if you don't want to. I'm just here to give you this and to make sure you're feeling good. Can we do that? Alright then. Here, take a seat. <sighs> you got any plates in this bachelor pad? I mean, what is this? <laughs> <sighs> there we go. Here. <sighs> Mm. How hungry are you? Scale of one to ten. Don't be shy. Come on. <laughs> Look, if, if you're not hungry, that's fine too. But just say so. Why would I get angry at you? It's just food. It's okay. Don't tell me this is the kind of bullshit she would start arguments with you. Over. Damn. Sorry to hear that. Uh, yeah, she, uh, she is fine. More than fine, I mean, she's still seeing him. She's kind of thriving, actually, and I know that's not what you want to hear, but... It's the truth. Hey, look at me. You can't keep doing this. She's not good for you. And, and you're beating yourself up over what? Her cheating on you has nothing to do with you. It has everything to do with her and her insecurities. You did nothing wrong. You are enough. You're amazing. There's nothing that you could have done to prevent what happened. She wanted to cheat on you, and she did. It's unfortunately just that black and white. And that's why I'm here, instead of with her. I kind of had an argument with her. 
I know. I'm here joining the club. I'll get at the back of the line. Seriously, she was well out of line and she seems to not even care. I've known her since we were kids, but this... She's not the person I used to know. Not anymore. I don't know when it happened, but... Somewhere along the line, she changed, and... I don't know if I like the person that she is now. You were the best thing that ever happened to her. And I mean that. We all, all of her friends, we all saw the things you did for her going above and beyond. And you didn't deserve anything that happened. I'm sorry. I, I wish. I wish I'd known maybe. Then I could have saved you some trouble. But I think she knows me well enough to know that she had to hide that sort of thing from me. I wouldn't have let it slide. Look, you... You need someone who respects you. Who treasures you and values you is not going to toss you aside. You're better than that. You always have been. I just want you to see it too. I'm sorry, I just. I'm so much better for you. Well, I would be if you... Fuck. Even if you just want to get revenge on her, maybe I wouldn't mind. Of course you don't. You're too good for that. I only meant that... Even if you were so upset your intentions weren't the best... I am shooting my shot. Rather poorly. I might add, but doing it nonetheless. You don't have to say anything now if you don't want to. But you do need to eat something. Here. Just a few bites, and if you want me to leave, I'll leave, but please. No, no, it's not like that. I never would have done anything. Not like that, not while you two were together, but... Screw her. All bets are off. After what she did? No. I wouldn't feel bad in the least. Not for her. No, this is not because of the argument either. God, I'm not that petty. I just...
I know the qualities that you possess, and I've seen what you do when you're in a relationship with someone and how infatuated you get. And you hold them in such a high regard. I've always wanted someone like that, I guess. I think you need to get out of the house. <laughs> no, it, it doesn't have to be a date. I just mean that you need to do something for you. It can be with me if you want, but it doesn't have to be. I just want you to feel better. So, you do want to go out with me then? <laughs> I promise you, the world didn't end. It keeps turning, and you're still here, and there are still people who care about you. Me being one of them. Well, at least you seem to be in a better mood, I think. <laughs> yeah, there you go. It's not hopeless. Well, no, it's the good thing about it. You know, after the bad comes the good. Well, I'd like to think I'm the good, but only time will tell. And you, of course. That's all completely <sighs> up to you. I am here at your discretion. I would hardly be upset if you turned me down. I mean, you're going through it. <laughs> Might not have even been the best time for me to confess if that's what that was, but... I couldn't sit on it any longer. And I thought maybe... Maybe you can use to pick me up. Well, is it not better to... Start something with someone you already know? Already have a friendship foundation with? That was my logic, anyways. I already know you. There's no X factor, no thing I would have to constantly guess about. I know you. I know what kind of person you are. The good and the bad. So I wouldn't have to worry. Same can be said for you. Well, towards me, I guess. You want me to stay? For how long? <laughs> Until you feel better. That's very specific. Well, I guess it's a good thing I have things in my car. I could stay the night if you wanted.
Hmm.